Alright guys, what is going on? Never safe line with it. D Man6996 here and today we are here in payday yeah. two actually. It's too late for me. We're here it's going to do a jewelry store death, jewelry man. store rob. Can't hear you. It's, it can get rough. We'll just have to trust him. And I'm playing with this bunch of team or this team that uh we have a really good guy on here. He's ranked 75. I'm ranked three, and I'm just trying to learn how to play. I've already made one mistake by actually skipping into the heist without making sure everyone was ready, so it was pretty disappointing uh, for me because I really don't want to. You got your two basic approaches here. You can either break the glass and just charge in and grab stuff. Hard mode requires six bags, so you're probably not going to make it all the way to six bags before awesome. the escape vehicle has to take off. But you'll get started at least. A stealthier approach usually involves us taking paths around the back of the store to clear out any guards behind there. And then trying to sneak in through one of the windows Watch the people. if there are any more guards inside. Or if the guards are all in the back, we all sneak in through the front and just dominate the people and the guards in turn. Try and keep them all from firing so that no one panics. It's up to you. Yeah, so this will be interesting. is interesting. Well, since we're all here, you just want to smash them and go? Let's see what he that says. sounds alright. You're the host, you start off. sure if this is what I should be doing or not, but uh... What's the melee button or whatever? I'll be totally honest, I, for I forget what the default is. Um, shoot, that's a good question. Um, I'll quick look. Yep, that's right. Alright, cool. I've got it mapped to one of my mouse buttons. Yeah, I should do that too. Okay, the alarm sounded, the escape vehicle had to take off, it will circle the corner and come around again in a few minutes. Let's try to keep all the jewels in this middle room. It's got a Xerox machine in it. It's a nice place to keep it so that the cops have to funnel through there if they want to steal the bags. Oh crap, I accidentally dropped that. Yeah, so I'm going to try and make this kind of like a voiceover type of thing. So, or not a voiceover, just mainly us talking together as a team and hearing the great teamwork that happens usually in payday Looks at least like that I've seen so far Door and is this recording is making more in the back making the, me lag oh my god you guys get to work on that I'll, I'll cover the street Alright, I don't see any more jewelry in here. There's movement in the alleys. Stay alert. Stay down.
let's look at something else. Uh, weapon gadget on off V. This guy called Junker Gibson, he's been giving me really good tips. Uh, as a, our whole team, he's been giving us really good tips. It's kind of dangerous on the streets there, like you don't want to hang out there. He's kind of starting to be a dick now, because he's probably sick of us. Uh... Oh, no, I think I'm doing pretty well in this game. You know, there's lots of things that I need to learn yet. Starting a game if they're in their inventory or anything like that. You found some gauge courier packages? You bet I did. Heck yeah. Anyway, Payday is a game that I got on a sale. I don't remember when it was. It was a while back, but. Um, holy crap, that's a lot of XP. Now we need to be careful and Let's see what I get out of here. We get a gun mod. Oh, this doesn't matter, suppressor. I can choose a heist without uh us going into the game, right? Yes. Protection meets destruction to war. Another day, another bank. My friend, you help me with small. We might have a very valuable object in the. I spent some time. We might have a very valuable. Looks like we've got a jewelry store that. My friend. My friend. I spent some time away in business. Protection needs destruction to war. The mole that needs to 
More work for Crazy Vlad. Excellent. Looks like you got five skill points right now. After you get the money together for something that's not the starter weapons, you should really look into the skill trees. Alright. Rule of thumb, until you get to like level 30 or so, it is highly to your advantage to spread yourself out amongst the trees. Um, okay. It costs a lot of points and money to go up to tier 3, 4, 5, and 6 in any of the skill trees. So you're going to want to spread yourself out to take advantage of some of the very cheap, universally useful skills in the skill trees. Just kind of play around with it. Alright. This game also lets you respec. You, when you respec a skill tree, it gives you back all the points you spent and half the money you spent. Wow. So it, it's, not that, it's not that punishing to, uh, to respec. So this is where I was talking about where I actually like, went in. And uh, I just pressed start the heist when they were still in their inventory. Kind of a dig move. But I didn't know it at the time, so... That looks kids. Jeez. Some of these are frickin' expensive. I guess that's why I keep playing this, so you can get more stuff. Be nice that we could get another person in here. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed my War Thunder content that I've been putting out because I've been really, really enjoying that game. Oh, I'm sorry, that was my phone. And, uh... All set. All right. Yeah, it's been something I've been really enjoying, and I'm hoping to get a lot of content out of closed beta tests. You know, I'm just trying to do what I can right now. And this will probably be my last one for payday. Yep, you heard him right. Vlad is serious. We'll go into the mall, we destroy as much as we can. Enough destruction, and this client. <sighs> Gal, I'm tired. These guys have to play this game a lot. You guys dude. Get in the game. I'd say new, but they're showing a lot of promise, a lot of skill. Nice. Yeah, a lot of people play Call of Duty or something. They can switch over pretty quick. Headshots. Get the out if you can. We don't need the necessary heat. I like to grab the gas cans. Get the helicopter.
helicopter coming sooner. Sure, hit it. Okay, welcome to Shield Shopping Mall. We've been sent here by Crazy Vlad to enact some revenge. He's been sent to prison for a while, just got back, and we're going to make this place burn for what they did to Vlad. The idea here is to cause $50,000 worth of damage. You'll do that by destroying windows, merchandise, anything that moves when you when you shoot it. Just go ahead and pick a target and light it up. I'd say go for the windows and the skylights, especially. What? I was. Sh oh my gosh. Go ahead, D-Man, start shooting and smashing. Playground here. There you go. Just unloading the stuff. If it breaks, it's money. If you ever wanted to smash up an Apple store, here's your chance. <laughs> and it looks like we got the helicopter coming. That's 50,000. Yeah, this is pretty awesome. Is there anything left? I do like this mission. Um, I played it one time before. And that was just by myself. Why can't I reload this thing? Come on. Yeah, I am kind of a noob at this game, but uh, just trying as best I can. Alright, so we got all three people right here. Oh my gosh. Lag like none other. Maybe I shouldn't be wasting this ammo so much. AK ammo. You really need AK ammo. Oh, this pistol is pretty good too. AK held more ammunition. Holds like 120 in the stock M4. Good job. Holds. <laughs> like a lot less. <laughs> or a lot more, excuse Get me. Get your bag and let's run. Excellent job. for a headshot, but I just had to pull the trigger before he got me. This was a good game match. This is going to be a lot of spending cash. Nice.
Alright guys, so just want to thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this Payday 2 gameplay of us robbing it. Jewelry, I think was the first one, and now doing this mall. But anyway guys, thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day, and I'll talk to you all later. Have a good one.